Example 2, we want to compute the bands F power distribution for the weighted voting system with a quota of 4, and the weight of the players are 3, 2, and 1. The coalition containing only player 1 has a weight of 3. This is a losing coalition, and so we don't need to worry about critical players. The coalition containing only player 2 has a weight of 2. It's a losing coalition, and again, we don't need to worry about critical players. The coalition containing only player 3 has a weight of 1. It's a losing coalition, and so no need to worry about critical players in that coalition either. The coalition containing players 1 and 2 has a weight of 3 plus 2, or 5. This is a winning coalition. If we remove player 2, the weight drops down to 3. This causes the coalition to lose, so player 2 is critical. If player 1 were to be removed, the weight would drop down to just 2, causing the coalition to lose, and so player 1 is also critical. So both players 1 and 2 are critical in this coalition. The coalition containing players 1 and 3 has a weight of 3 plus 1, or 4. This is a winning coalition. If we remove player 3, the weight drops down to 3, causing it to lose, so player 3 is critical. If we were to remove player 1, the weight would drop down to 1, causing it to lose, so both players 1 and 3 are critical. Next, the coalition containing players 2 and 3. The weight is 2 plus 1, or 3. This is a losing coalition, and so we don't need to worry about critical players. The coalition containing all the players, this has a weight of 3 plus 2 plus 1, which is 6. This is a winning coalition. If we were to remove player 3, the weight would be 3 plus 2, or 5, still winning, so player 3 is not critical. If we remove player 2, the weight goes down to 3 plus 1, or 4. It's still a winning coalition, so player 2 is not critical. If we remove player 1, the weight drops down to 2 plus 1 or 3, causing it to lose, so player 1 is critical. Now we need to count up how many times each player was critical. Player 1 was critical 1, 2, 3 times. Player 2 was critical only once. And player 3 also only critical one time. Next, our total. The total number of times that all the players were critical is 3 plus 1 plus 1, which is 5. And now to compute the power, bands F power distribution. So the power index for player 1 is 3 over 5, so 3 fifths. For player 2, it's 1 over 5, so that's 1 fifth. And for player 3, also 1 over 5, so 1 fifth. So one thing to notice about this example is that all of these players have nearly the same weights, 3, 2, and 1, but their power is very different. So player 1 has a lot more power than players 2 and 3. So that is all for this video. Let me know if you have any questions, and I hope you're having a wonderful day.